variations on it. Yeah. Yeah. In, with in more up in it. <laughs> um, depends on. Yeah. Snafu and Fubard happen a lot. Fubard, yeah. Yeah. Well, Fubard was uh, an American expression because they've been used to it more often than us. <clears throat> it is an American expression. Both of them are, but because the Americans built a highway going from Washington State up to Alaska that ah. went through British Columbia. Right. Um, and when they were building, they were mapping as well, so they named a lot of the creeks and streams and rivers in northern okay. British Columbia. So there's like Fubar Stream and Snafu Creek and so those words have entered Western Canadian vocabulary. Which to be fair is what we did when we were doing the same. So. Yeah. Not not in the same way. Yeah. We mostly name things after people who As opposed to after cursing phrases. Yeah, but military we jargon. mostly named them after people who are too bad. So <laughs> <laughs> right. More discreet. Maybe that's the difference. Maybe that's the difference between you and Americans. There's discretion involved. Yes, we're always discreet when we invade and, and rip up other people's countries. Well, I'm not sure Libby would feel that way right about now. <laughs> What's wrong with it, Mum? Well, the, I've got a flashing light, and from the manual, the flashing light says that there's something wrong with the right hand cartridge, which is the black cartridge. And these are not actually HP cartridges for Morrison's.